Good morning from Montreal. Jean-Serge Gagnon here. So do you sometimes wonder, well, look at that. I'm getting used to my, uh, to my, um, to my gimbal a little bit here. Okay, so today we're going to be talking about facing your fears head on. You know, I just started live just a second ago. I don't know what happened to it, but I'll see in a minute. But the thing is that I was listening to Darren Hardy. All right, so Darren Hardy is a master at success. He's been around for a long, long time. He's been doing things that have to do with you know, building a business that have to do with understanding your inner fears. And he was talking about, you know, facing your fears, right? He was talking about how everything in life is based, is like a pendulum, right? So everything goes one way or the other, up and down, left and right, the sun, the days and nights, you know, uh, we have fear and fear and, 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 you know, embracing, we have, we have success and failure. I mean, everything in life is, is you know both ways right so that means that if you're gonna if you have fears about doing anything you cannot you, you can't you gotta know that there's still gonna be failures you're still gonna you're still gonna have those fears that you have unfortunately will some of them will you know manifest themselves for example if you're afraid that people will laugh at you right if you're afraid that people will laugh at you and you do a video on on Facebook, there will be people that will laugh at you. That, 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 that That's the thing. You, there, there's going to be sadness. There's going to be negatives. There's going to be failures. But the thing is that you cannot get the success. You cannot get the, the happiness at the end uh, after the failure, after the, after the fears, unless you go through your fear. You've got to face your fear head on. And you have to accept that there's going to be some you know, some failures, some things that are not going to be fun. That's going to happen. And it happens to every single leader out there. You know, me, I've gone through lots of stuff I can't talk about, but there's lots of things that I've gone through that, you know, you would be like, oh my God, that's totally insane. What the hell are you, why are you even going on, right? And the thing is that that's the case for every single leader out there. You talk to any of the big leaders, you know, Eric Ward, Tony Robbins, I mean, they can tell their story now, right? And they talk about all these crazy difficulties that they went through, but that's because they faced their fears and they, they went head on to their fears and they just decided to go for it. And that's what, you know, all this simple online stuff is all about is, you know, making a decision, being consistent, being persistent, you know, figuring out what it is that you're actually trying to sell, you know, finding out who your audience is, all these things. We all have fears that, you know, what if we pick wrong? What if we choose the wrong thing to sell, right? What if we choose the wrong audience? You know, like, well, so what? If you choose the wrong thing, you're just going to learn that that thing is not the right thing. If you choose the wrong audience and you get lots of haters, well, you know that's the wrong audience. So you try again with the right audience. You keep going. You keep going. You keep passing your fears. You keep, you still do it. You know, if you're afraid of bees, if you're afraid of insects and, 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 and things like that, you're never going to get over that fear unless you face it, right? And I'm not saying you have to, because obviously those, those kinds of fears, you know, they're, you know, there's not much you can do. They don't really affect your life that much. So maybe it's not that big a deal. But at the same time, it's still, you know, something that you, if you want to, if you want to, you know, not have that fear anymore. You got to face it. You got to go right through it. You, like if you're afraid of, you know, um, spiders, well, you got to pick a spider up, put it in your hand to see that it's not going to, you know, eat you up or whatever, right? That fear, even though those fears are so hard to, oh, to, to, to deal with, the only way you can lose the fear, not have the fear anymore is to actually, you know, go through it, embrace it, face it head on. All right. So, you know, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you think you know anybody who could benefit from hearing this message, that you got to go through your fear. You got to face your fear. And that's the only way you can succeed. You get the success by facing your fear. If you think anybody needs to hear this message, and please go ahead and share this. And if you want to make sure you don't miss any of my videos on how to become a master of simple, just click on that notification up top there. Make sure you enable that to not to get notified whenever I go live. And also, if you're watching on YouTube, make sure you subscribe. All right. So face your fear, you know, just do it. Go through it. You know, face your fear head on. All right. So don't forget, go to masterofsimple.com also to register, get on the list. Make sure you don't miss out on any of these. I send these videos uh, also in your emails every day so you don't miss them 
and you also get my free ebook by the way the free ebook the top 10 simple online strategies that actually attract customers and team members to you right things you, you can do on social media to make sure that people actually you know are attracted to you so that's one of the most important things online right all right so go to masterofsimple.com put your name and email and we'll see you on the inside you have yourself a great day